Greetings, my name is Sporkinator, welcome back to Ocarina of Time. In the last episode, we took down the Spirit Barrier and the Forest Barrier. What comes next? Well, we can do them in pretty much any order we want. Except for we cannot do the Fire Barrier, it has something we need. From the Shadow Barrier, but I don't know what order I'm going to do these in, I'll just do the uh... What is this? The Water Barrier? Yeah, do the Water Barrier, why not, huh? It's actually it looks more like ice to me. I guess it's technically supposed to be the water area though. Oh, hello there. You, sir, are gonna die. Oh no, no 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 no. None of that, 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 you die. Why do these things keep falling? How many times are they gonna fall? Holy crap. Well, whatever. I'm probably gonna need blue fire for something, that's why it's here. What's in here? What's in here? Oh my gosh, it was a trap. I hate these things. Let me guess, another trap? I'm gonna laugh if it's a heart. Ha! 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 It is a heart. Okay. Okay, okay! Why do they think keep falling? Do they... What, do they continuously regenerate? Do I have to kill all the enemies? I don't know. But in any case, I'm gonna melt the blue fire that's in it. Not the blue fire. I'm gonna melt the red ice with the blue fire. And get that out of the way. I do have to kill these darn enemies. Alright, let's be smart. Let's not let them hurt us anymore. Okay, where are they? Where are they gonna pop up at next? Guess I just gotta walk around. There you are. Oh! That's it? <laughs> okay. That probably took longer than it should have, but uh, it's good. We're, oh, crap. Time limit. Time limit. Time limit. Okay. I have plan. Very good plan. You know what? I... Uh, I forgot to get more blue fire. I think I'm gonna need it. Yeah, I'm gonna need it. And I don't think there's any in the next room. Alright, alright, sorry about that. Anyway, yeah, there's a time limit, and I think I have a plan. We're gonna see how this works out. We're gonna push this one into the pit. Um, just like that. And then, I'm gonna come around this way. And I'm gonna push that one. Now, let's, uh, let's see. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh yeah, now I know what I'm doing. That's right. I did it, yeah, first try. I really hope I don't need any more blue fire. And you know, since I... Whoa, that was close. Since I already died to the spirit temple and had to use a fairy... I think there's another fairy here. Why not, right? I think the only way I could possibly die again is in one hit from... I don't know, bosses and stuff. And yeah, we'll worry about that later. Anyway, it is now hammer time. So that opened up a door somewhere. Presumably this one, because that's the way I came, right? I think so. Yeah. It's good. Ha, I smashed a pot with a hammer. There's no kill like overkill. Well, this is going to become a drill. Shooting the light arrows. We know the drill. Princess Ruto. Water berry is dispelled. Hurry up. Okay. Okay. Let's see. 
Oh, there's the shadow one. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that one. Because I think the shadow and fire are the only ones left, and we have to do the shadow one first for, uh, for reasons. You'll see why. And this is yet, yet more proof that the fire arrows are optional. Because you could shoot fire arrows at that there torch. And make platforms appear to come across, and they may be invisible, may require the lens of truth. I don't honestly don't remember. But I can get through this area without it. Uh, oh, it's a blue rupee? I didn't need that. Well, whatever. If I would have left it there, you guys would be all, Hey, what's inside that one chest that you ignored? And Yeah, I don't even know. But now I do, yeah. Basically, we can hookshot onto this torch to get across here. And then if we're really clever... We may have to stand right at the edge. To hookshot onto the like-like. Yep. That's the super cool way of getting across. I guess. Maximum arrows, that's quite nice. Well, I'm probably gonna need the hover boots. Maybe the lens of truth. We'll see. Yeah. The only way to get across is to hover. Oh, it's a little close, but we make it. There's a, a switch down here. Oh, that was that was uncomfortable. Anyway, thanks to that chest appearing, we can easily get back up and not die. And it's a big chest. Luckily, it's not a piece of heart. If it were, actually, normally at this stage of the game, if we got all the heart pieces and stuff, we'd be at our maximum. But basically, we get golden gauntlets. Look, he's already wearing them, even though we just got them. Isn't that strange? You can feel even more power coursing through your arms. Grab with A and lift stuff up. Okay, so... Uh, yeah. Our gauntlets are golden now instead of silver, and we can... You'll see later what we can do with them. Uh, oh, I need to go around to the other switch, don't I? Hold on. Yeah, Lens of Truth. I don't I don't feel like trying to do this without the Lens of Truth, because that would be crazy. The way this path curves and stuff. Oh, I need the hammer again? Okay. So that will open the door right up. And I believe we can take a shortcut straight to the door. Yeah, that's good. Oh, wow, we've already gotten to the shadow barrier. We're going to need light arrows and... Do I really need my Lens of Truth anymore? I don't know. But I'll re-equip the Ocarina and kind of use that to take a look at these new golden gauntlets we got. Fancy, huh? Anyway, yeah. That's like kind of the best way to check out the gold gauntlets, just bring up your Ocarina. Oh, I should have taken off the silver boots. Or not the silver boots. Derp. The hover boots. Magic refill. Very useful. Get some arrows that we don't need. And destroy the thing. The shadow barrier is dispelled. Please save the princess. Okay, Impa. I think there's only one barrier left now, just the fire one. Oh, no, I'm wrong. There's another one. Yeah, there's a fire and there's a light barrier. There's the light barrier. Ooh, yeah. We have the golden gauntlets, so we could do the light barrier right now if we wanted to, because that big thing that blocks it actually requires the golden gauntlets to lift. And there's a similar thing in here. Spork, it's so hot. Oh, it's hot in here. Okay. If it let me pause, there we go. All right, we're good. Now this thing's going down. But, if we equip the hover boots, we can avoid all that. Oh yeah, so much better. I think you can actually get through all this without the hover boots. But yeah, good luck. If you are unfortunate enough to come in here before getting the golden gauntlets, I'd really feel sorry for you you would collect all the silver rubies that you could see, and you wouldn't know about the one hidden 
up here. Oh, watch, this is gonna be epic. Hey! Hiya! We just pick up a gigantic stone thing and toss it across the room, no problem. I want a day's work for the hero of time. Well, thanks to the golden gauntlets, too. Ow. I don't even care. Hater's gonna hate. Now, I think if we don't take off the hover boots here, we're actually going to fall, attempting to go back. So we actually have to take them off to make that jump. Then I think I have to put them right back on. To, ow, get back over. No, ignore him. He's not worth it. But I'm gonna go over here and get this heart. Cause that's kind of worth it. Oh. Okay, so now we can just cross over to the other side. And take down that barrier. Oh, a heart. Good. And I don't need the hover boots anymore. And probably just take off the Goron, the Goron tunic as well. All right. Boom. Hi, Daronia. The fire barrier is dispelled. Hurry up, brother. feel like there's sound missing. Like, there's supposed to be or something to go along with that. Eh, hey, whatever. It's probably not important. I don't know. Dun 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 oh, I think this is the last barrier. We did spirit, forest, water. That's three. We did fire. That's four. And this is the fifth one? Uh, what am I missing? Oh yeah, we did the shadow. Did I not count shadow? Whatever, I'm pretty sure there's six barriers and we've only got one left. Oh, look at the way Link punches the ground for doing that. I just, that's so epic. Anyway. Yeah, that was super epic. Golden gauntlets are awesome. Here we have a Skulltula. Oh, no problem then. It's invisible. We could use the lens of truth to see it, but none of that is even necessary. Any chests that have enemies on top of them are actually not traps. The rest of them are dangerous, I think. So I probably won't bother. What do we got? Oh, blue rupee. Okay, so we open this and we get... Oh good, a heart. But in this chest we have what's really important, a small key. And the rest of the chest are traps. Take my word for it. And here we have a super difficult puzzle. Yeah, that was so difficult. Oh, let me guess, it's not actually gonna be the small key, right? But it is. Some puzzle that was. Oh boy, silver ruby time. With a time limit. I don't know where they get off on giving me time limits for random crap like this, but I guess they do. Ugh, I can't even see correctly. What is this? Arrows? Okay. That's not the last one. Which one did I miss? Oh, come on. Yeah, it's right here. What? I'm still missing one. 
This is bad. Oh, I see it. I, I see it. This place is just a pain. I'm never any good at it, no matter how many times I try it. Ow! For crying out loud. Oh, I went backwards. Wrong door. Silver rubies didn't come back, did they? No? Good. Derp. Went the wrong way. What's this? The barrier isn't there? And we have a wall master coming down on us, which I'm just going to run away from. Yeah, but the lens of truth reveals that. Switching back to Ocarina now. Oh good, a heart. You know what would make the three heart challenge really hard is if recovery hearts never spawned and you had to use recovery items. Man, that'd be... I think they actually did that with Skyward Sword, but I haven't played it. Like, they have normal mode, which is relatively easy, and they also have hero mode, which makes it harder. Or something like that. The light barrier is dispelled. Hurry! Yes, what's his name? Um, oh yeah, Raru. Oh, it did the sound that time, it went <laughs> Or whatever, with the wind sound, or whatever it was. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to do that with, with every teleportation that comes with taking down these barriers. But anyway, that's the last barrier. I don't know why I'm so thirsty tonight. I have a water bottle nearby, but I don't feel like putting down the controller to take a drink. <laughs> oh well. I know we're at 17 minutes. I should probably just end soon. Well, we'll see how it goes. You know, if you actually shoot these bats with light arrows, you can get 50 rupees apiece. I should show that off. I didn't even discover this until recently. But pow! Shoot them with light arrows. 50 rupees. Useless, though, because I'm already at maximum. Uh, the best way to get through is just run and ignore all the fire bats or fire keys or whatever. Oh, I never did identify these enemies, did I? They are... Dynolfos. Use your shield well and fight with Z-targeting techniques. Well, this shouldn't take two minutes. These guys somehow are more annoying than the lizard guys. Not sure why. Ow. How are you doing that? Defeating me like that. You're not allowed to. Die. Well, I got hit a few times, but I came out of the battle with full health. So that's... that's really good. This is like really long... Okay, that's not... Okay, there's a staircase, staircase later on that's much longer than that, so that's not even really that long. And you know, Stalfos, Bigeron Sword, they go together well. Now the other guy. And he's down. I freaking love that sword for fighting Stalfos. And look at that, we've already got the boss key. Yeah. So the red carpet marks the way forward. That's how we know we're going the right way. Oh, another staircase. Yeah, I'm gonna end the video real soon. Is this where I want to end? Yeah, I'm not sure. Let's see what's in here. Okay, iron knuckles. But yeah, it's been about 20 minutes, so I'm gonna pause here, folks. My name is Sporkinator, thank you for watching. Feel free to dislike, unsubscribe, and leave an angry comment. I will read it and laugh, and I will see you next time on Ocarina of Time 3 Heart Challenge. And yeah, I make a big deal about 3 Heart Challenge now, because this is like the most difficult part, being the final dungeon of the game and all that stuff. But yeah, I will see you next time. Goodbye.